Okay, in this video I just want to do a couple more water chemistry problems. So let's start with the first one. It says, what is the pH of a solution made by mixing 75 milliliters of one mole lactic acid and 25 milliliters of one mole sodium lactate? The pKa for lactic acid is 3.86. Okay, so we're dealing with another buffer solution problem. So the first thing I always like to do is write down my equation. which is the Henderson-Hasselbalch equation. And I also like to, after I get the equation down, know what I'm using, I'm go I also like to convert everything to liters. So that's going to be the second step here. So we'll have 0 0.075 liters of one mole lactic acid and 0 0.025 liters of one mole sodium lactate. Okay, and I also like to say in these problems what the total amount or total number of liters will be. So the total in this case will be 0 0.1 liters. So now we have everything we need. We need to find the new concentrations once these two solutions are mixed together. So in order to do that, we'll start out by saying 0 0.75 or 0 0.075, excuse me, is multiplied by one mole of lactic acid. and that's going to be over the 0 0.1 liters and that ends up equaling 0 0.75 moles of lactic acid and we're going to do the same thing now for the sodium lactate so we started out with 0 0.025 liters, I'm multiplying that by one mole of sodium lactate, over 0 0.1 liters. And that equals 0 0.25 moles of sodium lactate. So we have the two concentrations now that we need. So basically all we have to do from this point is just plug this all into the Henderson-Hasselbeck because we have the pKa already which is 3.86. So I'll do that down here. It says the pH is equal to 3.86 plus the log of sodium lactate. So that's 0 0.25 over 0 0.75 moles of lactic acid. So if you plug that into the calculator what you're going to find is that the pH is equal to 3.86 and it's plus about negative 0 0.48 and when you finally add those two together you wind up with a pH of 3.38 and that's the answer so we'll move right on into the second problem here which says what is the ratio of HEPIs to HEPIs H plus in a buffer solution with a pH of 7.9 and the pKa of HEPIs is 7.55 so this is actually a fairly easy problem, even easier than some of the other ones we've done so far. So we know that the pH is equal to 7.9 and we know that the pKa is equal to 7.55. So
So again, we're going to use the Henderson-Hasselbalch equation, and we're just going to set it up. So the pH is 7.9, and the pKa is 7.55, and that's plus the log of Hepi's over Hepi's H+. Plus. So again, just acid and conjugate base. So from there, we just subtract 7.55 from both sides. So 7.9 minus 7.55 is equal to the log of Hepi's over Hepi's H plus. So when you do that, what you'll find is that that's 0 0.35 is equal to the log of Hepi's over Hepi's H plus. So we take the inverse log of both sides, so that's 10, 3.5, over Hepi's, and that's over Hepi's H+, plus. okay? So basically the last thing to do here is to just plug that into a calculator and what you'll find is that this is equal to 2.24 and that is your ratio of HEPI's to HEPI's H plus and that's it so that's all I want to say for this video and uh, thanks for watching